Yes. And the feet are like eight holes. Yes. And the We yes. don't need the old from geo to old. We don't need to, we don't need old from geo to old. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. So, 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 so such kind, so, so my question is, uh, so this, this, this should be a refined study. Oh, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So do we have such general statement? Well, that's what I was trying to, to ask. Uh, not only the hill of one, but I think we should like to do it for arbitrary sure varieties. And the sure varieties is reduced mod p. Yes. And actually, I think we are not, at least I'm not matching these, in the possibility of making a complete conjecture there. I, I, I think if I understand Newman correctly, he was asking for a rich, sort of a stronger rigidity kind of problem yes. using using a smaller s sort of sub subset of Tekka symmetry. Ah. Uh, coming from sort of not coming from the whole group, but for instance coming from maximum forms or something ah. uh, something okay. closer to that. Yeah. But then inside uh, the one that's page being right, inside AG. Uh, yes, so inside AG or, or general Shimano. But then, of course, it stays inside the locus defined by your special properties, defined by your the Hilbert property, for example. So then it's dense in that sub variety, but not dense in homomorphic space. Did I understand your question? I think so. In some situations, in some situations for uh, Hilbert modular varieties or fake Hilbert modular varieties, what's actually has to be. Kind of, this kind of sort of very strong judicial statements. But personally, I don't know any other examples. And I don't have a uh, general pattern. Yeah. <laughs> Something I wanted to prove for you is that sometimes have an idea that over chain G D has to go to the answer to the <laughs> So this is a good <laughs> proof of that. Uh, you allow uh, in the statement of n to all conjecture. So do you allow the zero dimension of Shimano? Uh, yes, yeah, sure, yeah. Yeah. But if I may understand you, I mean the on the word is in uh correct to zero. Yes, with this uh uh Shimon variety attempts to definite for then algebra, not one definite. But if you want to change to practice with P, I have no idea. And if you have any idea how to change statements into practice with P statements, which are yeah, the really statement we have a result like this. But that's in practice with P. Yes. Now, oh, wait. Please explain me one of these things. I would be love to see that. Yes. That's the question here. Uh, yeah. In your family of uh, curves on around the form, yes. you said it's difficult uh, to know which lambda the yeah. coding has complex multiplication. Yes. But uh, is it easy or obvious that uh, these lambdas must be algebraic for the other for the to have something like that? Uh, the answer is yes. Uh, it's for the following reason. If your lambda gives the beam variety with CM, then this beam variety is defined over a number field. And if the Jacobian of the curve is defined over a number field, then the curve is defined over a number field. Perhaps not the same number field, but in any case over a number field. And then the lambda is defined over that number field. So I have a third question. If you take all lambdas which give you CM, then that lambda is over a number field. That was your question? Yeah. yeah. And the answer is yes, because the, the Jacobian is the mean variety of the CM, hence it's defined over a number field, hence the curve is defined over some number field, perhaps not the same, hence the lambda is defined over a number field. Thanks. But um, what is hard, if I give you the lambda, how do I decide but this is a CM value. And then I change tactics. I don't want lambda, I want tau, which is this matrix, which has complex multiplication, which happened to be the tau of Jacobian. Then what's the lambda? 
and I have no idea. And that's a hard problem. Yeah. Did, I, did I answer your question? Yeah. Okay, thank you. So, uh, so since we're past uh, almost 10 minutes past the three, so I think we'll stop the, uh, uh, asking questions in the open session. Anyone interested in asking uh, Professor Ord more questions, please stay. Uh, let's uh, give Professor Ord another round of applause.